Space Adventure started 30 years ago with the creation of SES and the launch of its first satellites. SES since has become a very multinational player in satellites. It has recently launched a governmental satellite in a private-public partnership with the Luxembourg government and it is currently a pillar of the Luxembourg space industry. But the Luxembourg space industry is more than only SES. Our space industry currently has more than 30 companies and accounts for at least 2% of the Luxembourg GDP. The recent Space Resources Initiative also shows that Luxembourg continues to go new innovative ways in the space adventure. In the context of the Space Resources Initiative, Luxembourg has introduced a new law on the exploration and use of outer space resources. This law provides a stable and predictable legal framework for space mining activities and also clarifies that space resources are able of being appropriated. This pioneering European legislation sends also a clear message that space operators are welcome in Luxembourg. One of the biggest challenges that the space industry will face over the next decade is to find adequate funding models. In the past we've seen mainly high net worth individuals that have funded the space industry. Now, lately we've seen more and more venture capital funds, but also public-private partnerships and other new models that are emerging. And we believe that Luxembourg, being the largest financial centre in the Eurozone and one of the largest investment fund centres globally, is well positioned to contribute to that democratisation of the investment into space. Our firm has had the opportunity to assist in the 1980s when the first satellites were launched. Since then we have continuously supported the space industry and the satellite industry and we have built up a firm expertise and experience in that domain. And we are now really looking forward to helping other businesses on their journey into space.